Hi, my name is Daniel Brown from the Animal Genetics and Breeding Unit. As part of our videos on helping you better understand your analysis, I would like to talk about what genetic linkage is and why it is vital for our genetic evaluation analysis which produces breeding values. So what is linkage, you might ask? Linkage is where breeders use the same genetics across multiple herds or flocks. This is mostly achieved by using the same size via artificial insemination. This genetic linkage between groups is an essential requirement for us to be able to compare the genetic merit of animals across groups, environments and time. By having the same genes present across groups, this enables the analysis to separate the environmental effects from the genetic effects and properly benchmark them across the whole analysis. If I use an example to help explain, just say we have the same animals, some animals running on irrigated pastures and some others on rangelands in western New South Wales. We cannot directly compare their genetic performance because we cannot quantify the impact of those different environmental conditions. However, if we know that some of these animals were from the same size, then we can infer from the performance of these linked progeny the amount of differences provided by the environment. Thus, when we add up all these linkages in the analysis, we can then compare the genetic merit of the animals across different environments. Linkage also needs to be thought about at different levels. We need linkage to compare groups within properties, for example, the AI females to the natural mates, between properties, for example, across all states in Australia, and between countries to compare between Australia and New Zealand, for example. For many of our analyses are also multi-breed, which means we have animals from more than one breed in them and we have the ability to compare the genetic merit across all these breeds. This is only possible when we have genetic linkage between the breeds and animals of different breeds compared head to head in the same groups. We also need linkage across time so we can compare and select across years. Because we have linkage across years, this also enables us to estimate the genetic change over time, and we call this our genetic trend. It is also important to note that linkage is trait de dependent. Different breeders record different sets of traits, so this means that linkage is not always the same for all traits. For example, not all breeders record reproduction traits, and these traits are only recorded in daughters, which makes linkage often lower for these traits. When buying bulls or rams, you need to make sure your seed stock supplier is recording all the traits important to you and they are linked to the analysis as a whole.